Hey guys, it's National Baseball Card Day and Weekend. Actually the first of two. Hopefully you got a chance to get out to either your nearest ballpark or your local card shop to take take uh, part in trading day and getting some, some freebies. I know all the ballparks that have home games this weekend are giving away free packs of cards. And those who are away gave out their packs last month. But your local card shops have free cards, free packs that are designated with the 2019 logo for the national holiday. Uh, they're actually giving away another card next week. We'll get into that in a second. I had the fortune, I have the fortune, of having two card shops near me within about 20 miles, 20 minutes of driving time in different directions, and I decided to go for it. And so, helping us tonight go through what we, I got um, with the free packs and some other goodies I got. We're going to have the Mick help us out. Dug him up and realized that next week uh, is going to be, I can't believe, 24 years since the passing of Mickey Mantle, August 13, 1995. So he's just hanging out with us and seeing what kind of goodies we got of the stars of today. So the first shop I went to, I actually got, yes, I know Mick. I got a few things. First, the first uh, Chase card giveaway is part of the promotion. Bryce Harper as a Philly, of course. Uh, interesting to note that there's so much blue in the Phillies uniform in this shot. The sleeves, the hat, uh, not used to seeing that. I'm used to the old school pinstripes of Larry Bowe and Manny Trio. So this is the first of two Chase cards you'll get. This came out on the 10th of August, 10th and 11th. If you missed out, Saturday the 17th, they're giving away another chase card. Oh, this one of Vladimir, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. And you know, the, the fine print says you got to spend $10 on Topps items in the store, but I think they just give it to you anyways. I think each store gets 50 packs and 50 cards. So each pack is wrapped in cellophane. It comes with the logo on the back. There's six cards in each pack, and this one has Miggy Cabrera on the front. I'm going to go ahead and open it. Let's see who else we get. So it's got the date on the back with the Tops logo. Miggy Cabrera. Nice looking cards. Lots of uh, space there for photos. Jose Barrios of the Twins. Manny Machado, another free agent who moved over with a big, big contract during the off season. This guy is, has a new career with Houston. Justin Verlander, just when you thought he was pretty much done with. He's having a great, great second half of his career. And here's your Red Sox star, Mookie Betts. And then this little advertisement for the promotion. So you get, this is Star Cars is what you're getting here in this one. And I also picked up at the store a couple of living set players. I just saw them, I just, I just had to have them. Hank Aaron, I think he's got about 11,000 or so they made of this card. These are all looking like the 1953 tops, part of the living set. It's number 46. And this is a really cool looking shot of a young Hank with Milwaukee. And the other one I picked up for another one of my collections is Donnie Baseball, Don Mattingly. I think they made about six or 7,000 of this one. He's number 85, cool looking headshot the five o'clock shadow and a little wispy hair. It's about 1986 or seven, looks like, from his, from his playing days. The second store I went to later in the afternoon also gave me a pack of cards, Elvis Andrews on the front, and also picked up a few, another Don Banningley, didn't even realize it, a uh, variation from his 91 tops with his correct stats on the back. And when we get to talking about the late 80s, early 90s, and variations, we'll get into detail about that. Um, I picked up a few 89 variations. There were a lot of future star cards that had differences in the amount of space uh, that the future star template had. So the, the, it looks like the picture was actually shifted up or down. So a few variations, nothing, nothing crazy. A couple different Gary Sheffields and a Greg Jeffries. Hope to finish that master set. We're almost there on that one. And as for the second pack, of six cards. We 
have Elpis Andrus, I said, from Texas, a Josh Bell, Kristen Yelich, reigning MVP. This guy's not too shabby. He is the talk of the baseball card stores. Uh, both shops I went to today had definitely more traffic than usual uh, for the time I went. And this is the guy they talk about, Mike Trout. He's the guy. And he is being compared to Mr. Mantle in some circles. But can't go wrong with that. And Matt Chapman of the A's, full of stars. Six cards in each pack. And I also picked up from the store. I couldn't pass it up for 10 bucks. I'm sure you see in the back, I got a few packs. But a 24 count cello box of 1990 tops. 24 in here and there's 11 extra the guy threw in for 10 bucks I got 35 packs of cellos um, they were 89 cents back then I didn't even realize there were this much 89 cents 31 cards and a stick of gum which I will not eat so beginning of the new year January of 2020 will be the 30th anniversary of the release of this set and I think I will be patient and finish up the videos I want to make and, and share with you all first on my sets and my player collections and all the other good stuff I have in mind and then in the beginning of the new year I think we'll start cracking these open and look for that Frank Thomas NNOF no name on front it's, it's a it's a it's a gamble probably uh, not much luck in doing it but you know for the price can't go wrong also the Griffey Gold Cup rookie is a great card to pick up as well lots it's a 30 year old set already I can't believe it uh, lots of Hall of Famers in that and it's a fun looking set with the colors and the colored borders. So that's it for now. Got my 90s, got my Trout and Yelich and cards from the giveaway day. A couple of living set guys and some variations, which I always, I always love to get. So pretty good day at the card shops. Pretty good holiday to celebrate. Hope you all are enjoying yours. Hope you get a chance to get out to the ballpark, to your local shops, give your brick and mortar mom and pop shops some love and some support. You know they need it. And um, can't wait to see what you guys come up with. And we'll talk to you soon.